Storybird lets anyone make visual stories in seconds. Using a large range of artwork from illustrators and animators around the world, you can use these images to inspire writers of any age. It's a simple idea. Students and teachers can read other stories or create their own using these animations. To read a story, go up to the top bar and click Read. You can choose a wide range of stories that were written by others. You can search by age, by format, by categories, or you can just explore what was popular or new and noted. If you want to create your own writings, go up to the top and click Write. From here, you're able to choose from a wide range of artwork and create your own stories. I'm going to look under the hashtag Quest. If I want to enjoy this illustration, I can click the Use This Art button. For a long form book, a picture book, or a poem, I will choose picture book. I can use the marker to add another image. I can preview other images on the margins. I can replace the image and I can start typing in my story in the text box. To add additional pages, use the plus sign on the lower right. To save your story and work on it at another time, click Save on the lower left. Go ahead and click on Menu. You can save and close. You can publish the story online, or you can invite a collaborator. When you click Invite Collaborator, this allows you to invite others to add their own pages to your story.